Now to the coronavirus pandemic and the race to vaccinate. Within the hour, U.S. regulators have given the okay to mix COVID-19 shots for boosters as they give the green light for booster Moderna and Johnson & Johnson doses. This as health officials reemphasize the need for all of us to protect ourselves, especially frontline health care workers. CBS 4's Jacqueline Quinn reports. And we do know that the frontline workers received the vaccines very early on, and so the time has passed and their uh, level of immunity has gone down. Dr. Eileen Marty, an infectious disease specialist at FIU, helps track COVID data. She tells CBS4 the rate of vaccination among those eligible to get the booster shot is high. Currently, it's open to those who are 65 and older, immunocompromised, or those with high risk exposure, such as frontline health workers. The booster, important to consider because the more time that passes, the less antibodies you have. But you don't necessarily have enough to keep you from getting infected and being able to transmit to others. And that's why the booster shot makes a lot of sense, especially as COVID is still able to spread to medical workers, some diagnosed with breakthrough cases. We have had hospitalizations in healthcare workers uh, even after uh, being vaccinated. Um, that uh, does occur. What we don't see are the amount of deaths. So when we, or ICU admissions. So the great majority of what we consider breakthrough cases of vaccinated people uh, coming down with COVID are not work related. The viral load varying with COVID variants. Dr. Sergio Segarra with Baptist Health South Florida credits the vaccine with helping prevent some breakthrough cases among frontline workers from becoming worse. Well, we are seeing breakthrough cases in our associates. And Dr. Margaret Gorensek with Holy Cross Hospital in Fort Lauderdale explains the Delta variant is highly contagious, like chickenpox. About 50% of our healthcare workers that did develop COVID had been vaccinated, but none of them had to be admitted. They were all mild symptoms. Dr. Gorensek says while breakthrough cases do grab attention, there are often underlying conditions that contribute to how well a person is able to fight the virus. For a full list of locations where you can get vaccinated, go to the coronavirus section of CBSMiami.com or download our app. In Kendall, I'm Jacqueline Quinn, CBS4 News.